Hello everyone, welcome to the ARWS Depot Cup Series All-Star Race. We're... This is a race combined of every winner of the season along with the showdown winner, Jeffrey Buckeye, who is starting in last place. Well, Mason Wood, your ARWS Depot Cup Series champion, is on the pole. With championship runner-up, Nick Mace, right next to him. 34 laps, no cautions. Showdown had a pretty good finish between Jeffrey Buckeye and some others, so. so now Michael Block has moved under Mason Wood. This race is fair game. You can do what you want, in a sense. First lap we remain calm, but usually it's after the first green flag lap that things start to get really crazy. Also, a big announcement. Um, we have decided to go from the instead of going to using the 2007 car tomorrow cars, we're going to be using the 2008 car of yesterday car set that was sent to me by Michael Block, who is actually leading right now. So, just letting you guys know, because I like the styling of these small cars, and I don't think we should use the car tomorrow just yet, but. I may do, if I do a second series, we'll probably use the car tomorrow for that one, so just letting people know. Oh, contact between the teammates. Oh, oh that caused a wreck. Oh, boy. Oh, Nick Mace is flipping it wildly. Welp. Well, that didn't work. Um, I guess we'll... Don't Schwalmer is going to forces him up there and then they wreck. Nick Mace gets caught in the catch fence and catch fence and then Let's watch Daniel Day here. Wow. Noah Hart has the most wins this season and he's already out of this race. Max is out, Richard Johnson's out, Daniel Day's out. Michael Block is your leader, Angel Navarro behind him, and Dylan Schwallenberg. It's Richard Johnson, looks like he's going to try and make some hell for these drivers when they get to him. Like that. Oh, Richard's slowing down, Michael Block there. It's going to help. Looks like Richard trying to help his teammate, but now he's holding up his teammate. Schwallenberg caused the wreck. He's under Michael Block right now. Eugene Max just came down Pear Road. Where's Mason Wood? He's in sixth. So now Justin Perry is trying to get up to him. Jeffrey Buckeye, he's moved up a good amount ever since that wreck. Gonna have to try and avenge his teammate. We got three car battle for the league going on. And with these Dylan Schwalenberg, about all 400 cars have won. Uh, apparently, RCR might go. Block there. RCR is looking for a new team. Is looking for a new driver to drive either the 07 or the 31 or somebody. Oh boy, they're three wide. Can they stick it? So oh boy. Oh, Schwalberg hits the wall there. The back slows down Navarro. That's gonna allow Michael Block to breeze by. Down the straightaway. A couple of guys are just pulling around this track at the moment, just trying to get by. Eric Burns and Fourth are slowly working their way. Schwalberg hit the wall. 
few laps ago. He's trying to gain back on those two. DEI won the championship. So, um... DEI won the championship. They actually had two drivers in contention for this for the uh, championships and they managed to come out of it with as champions. Aston Wood did a great job of coming back after a horrible start to the season. I no one really saw him coming late into the game, but Angel Navarro won the wild card spot, but she never really got anywhere in the whole entire chase. She never really had a good finish. Which is a shame for her because she had a good amount of wins. Now Michael Block making the pass. Block was where it was driving the Reese's car, but that car got wrecked, so now they pulled out the shell car as a backup. Same for Navarro. They brought out the orange and the orange 11. Oh boy. Michael Block was the winner at Talladega, at Talladega 2. Which earned him a spot in the chase, pretty much. So we are approaching the halfway point. Or we're actually at the halfway point now. We got three drivers battling for the lead. It's Dylan Young. He's trying to catch up to them. They're running. Looks like they're slowly catching up. You know, Vero's got a very fast car. She did okay at Charlotte. Schwalmberg wrecked at Charlotte, wrecked at the uh, finale. Comes Jeffrey Buckeye from last place all the way up to fourth. The car was very fast during the showdown. Looks like they may be catching up. Oh no, hard to say. A block underneath Angel Navarro again. Got a couple lap cars here. Like Eugene to Max. Oh boy, slowly slowed both drivers down. Oh, there they come. Here comes the hunters. Oh, okay. Careful, Richard. Okay. That did not help. Now, uh oh, here comes the cavalry. They can get by these lap cars. Dylan Young's going to get by. Max holding up Justin Perry, though. Dylan Young is flying by all the lap cars at the moment. He's going to try and get himself once again involved in a, in a win. Dylan Young won the finale race. Would love to come out as the all-star winner and earn himself a reserve spot. Now Cody Loves is there. Michael Block going to try and squeeze under Schwalenberg.
Dylan Schwalenberg did, uh, had a very average season. He didn't really do too much, but he didn't do too less. Dylan Young now, he's moving. Trying to become the trying to get a forward in this in this uh fight for the fight for the lead. Justin Perry's trying to get up there. Dylan Young is way faster than these guys or way faster than Schwan where he's really catch he's reeling them in right now. About 2.2 seconds faster. We have four drivers of each different teams. So. Wallenberg, man, he's really trying. Dylan Young is now in the fight for the win. Must be very happy. I'm sure Dylan Young would like would love to sweep Charlotte. Angel Navarro is hanging tough. Here it comes Dylan Young to stick himself into this battle with about six laps to go. Uh, Schwalmer comes right back onto Dylan Young is going to try and shove him out of the way. But Michael Block is trying to focus his sights on Angel Navarro. The battle continues on. We got Eugene to Max. He's very slow. Might catch up to him. Dylan Young is trying now to work his way past Michael Block. It's a very fast. Oh, 29 hit the wall there. Dylan Young trying to charge on to him. Oh, whoa, contact between there. Wow, oh, 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 my goodness. All oh, the leaders wrecked. Oh, God, oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. The top four wrecked. The whole top four is wrecked. Justin Perry flies right by him. Three laps to go. Justin Perry's all by himself. He's got no competition. got no one. The top four just wrecked. Mason Wood is very far behind. He's about a, a full straightaway behind. A good chunk of the field spread out. Michael Block is blown up. Not that many drivers left on the track. Justin Perry is going to go through two more turns to win this. And he's going to do it. A very lucky Justin Perry will win at Charlotte and the Season 2 Reserve spot. That bet he's going to want that 24. Justin Perry wins.
by a pretty lucky guy. A slow lap car. I was not expecting this. I thought it was, I knew it was going to hold something up, but Dylan Young was trying to get by. Dylan Young tried to force Angel Navarro into the max. Wow, and Schwalenberg would have had that locked up if he had gotten through that. He would have had that locked up. Wow, oh! Then we had more drivers pile in. This was the four behind. Oh, one got involved. The eight spun. Dang, that was a huge crash and it took out the leaders. Let's get a quick onboard and then we're gonna leave. Then both drivers are used as a pick and flew in the driver too. Well, congrats to Justin Perry on the win. He and Mason Wood are have won reserve spots for season two. So hope you guys enjoyed watching this somewhat chaotic race and we'll see you guys for season two.